Hey everybody, now today I would like to review for my vlog video the movie Monsters vs. Aliens, which is um the the most recent DreamWorks anime picture I've seen. I haven't seen How to Train a Dragon, but so. Now before I get started, quick shout to one anime game, more beauty, and Grand Flip. They left some nice comments on my videos. Check these people out, I'm his friends, and subscribe. Now back to Monsters vs. Aliens. Monsters vs. Aliens um, was like a film last year that released, it was in 3D. I didn't see it in 3D, I just saw it on DVR. It was basically about um, a girl named Susan, voiced by Reese Witherspoon, um, who is about to get married to this guy named Derek, who's a TV weatherman, who's played by Paul Rudd. And um, the, a couple minutes before she's about to get married, a meteorite hits her. And the meteorite has this thing called quantonium in it. And it hits a, something that causes her to like grow, like, like attack the 50 foot woman type height. And, and basically the, um, the government comes and gets her and classifies her as a monster. And she, they take her to this facility where um, there's other um, monsters, um, inclu um, including Dr. Cockroach, who's voiced by Hugh Larry, um, who some of you know from the Stuart Little movies, um, B.O.B. or the or Blob, um, voiced by Seth Rogen, who like four-year-old version knocked up and stuff like that. Um, the Missing Link, um, voiced by Will Arnett, and um, this um, this big insect. I I don't know who voices him, but. Um, and no. actually, and the government classify her instead of Susan to um, Ginormicus. And but their leader is this guy, General W. R. Munger, who's voiced by Kiefer, Su Kiefer Sutherland. And they basically um, one day um, an alien named Galaxar, voiced by Rain Wilson, um, comes comes um, to down to earth to obtain plutonium and basically conquer the world and the pre and so the president um, voiced by Stephen Colbert who on anime she's he like the dorkiest like weirdest looking president I've ever seen but whatever um, like they're invaded and so their only option is to have the monsters go up against the aliens so Monsters vs. Aliens is kind of like those like town movies like Stink on a Play or something where the title basically explains itself. Now, um, it's not my favorite out of all the um, DreamWorks films. I think um, sh like Shrek, the Shrek, some of the Shrek movies in Madagascar 2 and stuff like that are some of my favorites. But I did like this one. I I thought there were some funny moments. Some moments. I like one of the funny moments I could say. There's a moment where... Um, he, um, the president goes up to, like, this big, huge, um, me med uh, metal robot alien thingy, and he starts, like, playing, like, this piano thing, and he starts, like, jamming on it. It's kind of funny. And there's another thing where they're showing, um, um, pictures of all the different monsters and how they became, and there's, there's this girl that screams three times, and then the fourth picture... They think it's the girl screaming, but it's really the president. I thought that was kind of funny. And there, there's some good, there's some sweet moments. Um, I like Reese, I like Reese Witherspoon, and her. I think Reese Witherspoon's good. Seth Rogen was good. He's very. Everybody was. Everybody was good. Um, and the spe and the animation. Um, I think like the almost kind of dark stuff, like the metal robots and the shields and the um outer space stuff. I think that was really that that stuff was really cool. Although. I, there were some moments where I could tell it was probably in 3D, but I kind of wish I saw it in 3D. And I was actually kind of almost surprised, I don't know, but because before I thought it was going to be kind of just, you know, okay, because I didn't really know, and I thought it was really good. So I'm going to give the movie three stars. Now, in the comment box, tell me, one, did you see Monsters vs. Aliens? Um, two, did you like Monsters vs. Aliens? And three, I think I might, I don't know if I asked this question before or not, but whatever. What is your favorite DreamWorks anime film that you've seen so far? So let me know in the comment box. Well, I guess that's it. See you later. Bye.